Hello little artist, I'm Mariana Olson and today we are drawing a backpack folding surprise. Are you ready? Let's do this. Ok, we are going to need paper, something to color with and using markers and something to draw with. I will use a black marker that you can change for a pencil. We are going to start folding the paper in half. Then we are going to take the bottom part and fold in half again. Now we are going to flip it over and fold one more time. And then we're gonna open it, you're gonna flip it, and we're gonna start drawing right here. Okay, little artist, let's start with this picture and the paper. I have it in this way and opens to the top like this, and it's in a horizontal way. Let's start with the paper close, and we're gonna start in the center of the paper, and we're gonna do a line, horizontal line, and we're gonna do a letter U underneath this line and this is going to be the first pocket now let's do the zipper line and we're going to do two lines here on the top and underneath the lines we're going to do a triangle shape and this is going to make it look like the zipper now let's go here and we're going to leave three finger space and we're going to do a little dot let's do the same on the other side three fingers and we're gonna put a little dot. Now let's go from side to side doing a big upside down letter U, going around and crossing to the other side. And you should have a little bit of a space between the end of the paper and the picture. So here we can go put the handle. So here we can put the handle and we're gonna pass really close to the end of the paper. Okay, now let's cross the folding part and we're gonna go down with this line and we're gonna stop before we get to the end. Let's do the same in the other side. And now let's join them on the bottom with a line that goes really close to the end and it's curvy. Now we're gonna do a pocket here on the bottom and we're gonna start by leaving a space and do a curve and leaving a space and do a curve and these ones are on top of the folding part. And now we're going to turn the paper to join them from side to side. And now we're going to cross the folding part going down here too. And we're going to stop before we get to the end. And now let's join them with a curved line. Now we're going to put a little bit of a dot line that is going to go really close to the first lines we did. And this is going to make it look like the thread that goes around. And we're going to go across the folding part and keep going on the top. We're going to do two more pockets on the sides and we're going to start here with a curve and go down and connect to the other one. In this side, we're going to do the same. And the last thing we're going to do is the straps that go on the backpack. We're going to start here on the top in this corner and we're going to go down with a curve. It connects with the pocket. Now we're going to do one more and this is just half of the curve. Let's repeat the same steps starting on this corner, going down. Now let's do one more inside. If you want, you can put a face on this backpack and I'm going to do here two oval shapes. Here I'm going to make it big and I'm going to make another one. And we're going to fill this with black. And a little smile here on the bottom and on top of the eyes without crossing the folding part, two eyebrows. That's it for the outside. Now let's open the paper. And we're going to first start connecting these lines. So I'm going to go here really slow, trying to go straight and connecting this line right here. You can use a ruler if you want to, but I'm just going to use here. I'm going to do it by hand. Just like this. Okay, now let's connect this line with this one. And the same thing, we're going to go slow going down. And now the other one.
And so to make it look more like uh, the straps of the backpack, we're gonna do here in two lines and these straps. And here behind this, we're gonna do a line that goes down and connects here. I'm gonna repeat it in this side. I'm gonna do kind of like a curve going out, going down and connecting. The next thing will be do the pockets or extend the pockets. I'm just gonna cross here the folding part and connect to the other side. And I'm gonna also do the dot lines. And here we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna extend this pocket here with lines. Now next we're gonna do all the school supplies. They're gonna go in here. You can choose the supplies you want to put inside. I want to start with a pencil doing two lines and these lines are a little diagonal. Okay, now in between the lines we're going to do triangles that go up and down. And on the top we're going to put one more and here we're going to close and fill with black. In this side we're going to do an apple. In this apple we're going to start with a curve, leave a space and in this corner I want to do the other one. Now let's do here a curve that points down and we're going to do the stem of the apple and the leaf back here with a little line. In behind the pencil we're going to start doing a notebook with a line that goes up and I want to stop here on the folding part and now I'm going to cross and we're going to go down and connect here. We're gonna put the a spiral of the notebook. We're gonna do a line that goes down, down, going around until we reach here, the pencil. We're gonna do a little line and we're gonna do this one here double just to make the lines. And before we get to the corner, we go down. In behind this one, we're gonna do another pencil, but we're gonna do it upside down. So we're gonna do a line one that goes to the right and another one that goes down right there. We're gonna mark here a little square or rectangle and on the top we're gonna do a half a circle. And this is the eraser. We're gonna do this line double. In behind all this we're gonna put the last thing is gonna be a book and it's gonna go pointing to the left. We're gonna go behind this line going up. I wanna do this line double. Now we're gonna cross on the top. It's a diagonal line. Now we're gonna go up again. And from here, we're gonna start going down in a diagonal line. If you look here, go up and down. Now that we have all the school supplies we want, we're gonna join this line here. And if this line cross any of your uh, school supplies, you just go in behind. We're gonna do the same here. We're gonna cross and connect. And the last thing, I wanna put some faces, some funny faces on my supplies. If you wanna skip this part, that's okay. I'm gonna do this, the faces very easy, just doing dots and little smiles here with the eyebrows. And this one, we're gonna do the same thing. Two little dots for the eyes, a smile, and I wanna put here a little tongue. Now here, the same little eyes. And for this one, I'm gonna make a bigger smile and a bigger tongue. And in this one, we're gonna make it like he's sleeping, okay? And this one barely can see his eyes. And there, that's it. We finished this picture of a backpack. Now let's go see how it looks when we close. And this is how it looks when we open. I hope you like this lesson and I hope you're very ready to go back to school. And now my favorite part, let's color. Okay, little artist, we are done. This is how my picture turned out. Now that it has all the colors, remember you can change everything in this backpack. You can add more pockets, you can change the face and choose different colors. Now let's take a look in the inside and this is how it looks. 
Remember, you can change all this or put a different surprise inside your backpack. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss lessons step by step like this one. See you next time!